Hello my dears, my name is Hassan Faiz, I am master in English from Namal Inama, qualified and certified English teacher. So this is my short introduction, enjoy my teaching, let's get started. In this class I will teach you preposition of. So preposition of is used in the following situations. Number one, I fell off the ladder. Number two, I fell to the ground. Number three, I fell in love with you. I have written uh, these three sentences just uh, to make you understand how they are different from each others. So with the same verb fell, as you know fell, fell is the second form of fall. So fall, fell, fallen, in this uh, verb uh, of to in, these prepositions are used to end, they give different meanings. So number one, I fell off the ladder, I, I fell off the ladder, it means that you come down from the ladder, so you fell off the ladder. Number two, I fell to the ground, for example if you are walking and you slept down, so you fell to the ground. Number three, I fell in love with you, when you start love with someone, so you can say I fell in love with you. So I fell off the ladder, I fell to the ground and number three, I fell in love with you. Number four, you are getting white off the subject. For example, if you are discussing a topic and you start something else irrelevant uh, talking, so you can say that you are getting right off the subject. It means that you are leaving your man subject, so you are getting right off the subject. Number five, our office is located off the main road. Off the main road, it means that this is the main road and our office is a little away from the main road. So you can say our office is located off the main road. So all these uses are as preposition. Number six, she is two days off school. She is two days off school. It means that she does not come uh, to school for two days. So she is two days off school. Okay. Number seven, he is finally off drugs. So it means that he stopped using drugs. So he is finally off drugs. He is finally off drugs. Number eight. I am off meat for a month. I am off meat for a month because uh, uh, I uh, am. I have some illness, so I am off meat for a month. I will not eat meat for a month. So I am off meat for a month. Now here, off is used, but uh, here in these sentences, from one to eight. Of is used as preposition, but here of is used as adverb. And as you know that adverb modifies a verb, adjective and another adverb. So here it is used as adverb. Now you see take your coat off, take your coat off or you can say, uh, we can say that uh, put your coat on and take your coat off. Number 10, the meeting is off. It means the meeting is cancelled. Today the meeting is cancelled, so the meeting is off. The water is off. Here is not water. Water is not available in the uh, water pipes, so the water is off. The TV is off. Yes, the TV is off. I am listening to some music, but I don't know the TV is off. The TV is off, but I don't know where this music is coming from. The TV is off, it means that it is not on. Number 13, how many days did you take off? How many days did you take off? It means that how many days uh, you took leave? You took leave. Number 14, I need some time off. For example, if you say I am very tired and I need some time off. I need some free time. I need some time when I don't work. So I need some time off. 15. 
shoes are 20 percent off shoes are 20 percent off so you can buy shoes on this sell point 20 percent off it means that uh, you will pay 20 percent less price 16 switch off the lights for example if you say to someone that please switch off the lights switch off the lights or switch on the lights this is dark so switch on the light and switch off the light switch on the light and switch off the light number 17 we got off the car we got off the car we got off the bus we got into the car we got off the car off is adjective so adjective uh, you know that uh, adjective is uh, uh, a different part of speech so off is used as adjective here this fish has gone off this fish has gone off it means that this has rotten this is not eatable the milk smells off it means that the milk smells off it means that the milk is also uh, not usable and here off as idiom so we can also use off as idiom as in this sentence you see it rained on and off all day it rained on and off all day it rained on and off all day it means that uh, it rained uh, from time to time for example it uh, rained for some time and then stopped then again rained then stopped then again uh, rain then stopped so in this way it uh, on and off on and off okay so of as prefix we can also use of as prefix as in these uh, in this uh, sentence you can say off air record recording yes this is off air recording it means that this will not be broadcasting on any uh, tele <coughs> television or sorry or any other electronic media so this is off air recording but uh, if uh, your speech or your discussion or debate is uh, uh, is uh, is on air it means that it is broadcasting off the record on the record it means off the record yeah it is not <coughs> recorded but on the record it is recorded it means on the record it is uh, publicly and officially it is written and it is on record but if it is not officially and publicly uh, recording so you can say off the record yes we are talking in or uh, this talking will be off the record it means that it will be limited uh, just uh, between us so you can say that it is off the record okay now a few sentences i want to translate in urdu so for the urdu speaker it will be easier to understand the meaning so you are getting you are getting right off the subject aap apni mauzu se hat rahe hain number 6 she is two days off school us school se do din chutti par hai i am off meat for a month main ek maa ke liye gosht se pares par hu Take your coat off, coat utaro, put on your coat or coat pehno. The meeting is off, meeting cancel hui, ijlas cancel hui. The water is off, the water is off, the water is off, pani nahi hai. The TV is off, TV off hai, ye to asan baat hai, TV off hai. How many days did you take off? Iska matlab hi hua ki aapne kitni din? chutti ki how many days did you take off i need some time off mujhe kuch waqt farigh hone ki zarurat hai yani mujhe kuch chutti ki zarurat hai so i need some time off switch off the lights light lagao ya light roshan karo aur switch on the light sorry switch off the light switch switch off the light switch off the light iska matlab ye hua ki लाइट बंद करो स्विच ऑफ द लाइट लाइट बंद करो स्विच ऑन द लाइट लाइट लगाओ सो स्विच ऑफ द लाइट लाइट बंद करो स्विच 
ऑन द लाइट लाइट लगाओ वी गॉट ऑफ द कार हम गाड़ी से उतरे वी गॉट इन टू द कार हम गाड़ी में सवार हुए हम कार में सवार हुए दिस फिश हैज़ गॉन ऑफ इसका मतलब ये हुआ कि ये मछली सड़ चुकी है दिस फिश हैज़ गॉन ऑफ ठीक है इट रेंट ऑन एंड ऑफ ऑल डे इसका मतलब ये हुआ कि सारा दिन वक्फे वक्फे से बारिश जारी रही सो दीज वर प्रपोजेशन एंड दीज आर एडवर्ब्स ऑफ एज यूज एज एडवर्ब एंड दीज आर डिफरेंट यूज ऑफ द वर्ड द वर्ड ऑफ सो ऑफ इज यूज इन ऑल दीज वे एज अ प्रपोजेशन एज एडवर्ब एंड एज एजेक्टिव एडियम प्रिफेक्स सो दिस इज द एंड ऑफ माई क्लास फॉर मोर ग्रामेटिकल एक्सप्लेनेशन वॉच माई वीडियोज कंटिन्यूसली थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग प्लीज सब्सक्राइब लाइक इन शेयर माई मैसेज टू द वर्ल्ड इज सर्व ह्यूमेनिटी बाय बाय